Hello everybody, uh, welcome to a live business update from Viva MKHQ. Um, well, what can I say? Um, it's been an amazing first quarter. The first quarter is not over yet, of course, it's over next week. But it has been an incredible start to the year. As you already know, um, we open our own fulfillment facility, um, which means we have greater control of what we do and a, a greater ability to service you, our business, in the way that we want to. And there's a point I really, really, really want to clear up. And that point is quite simple. When you deal with me or you deal with any of the team or who are all here, when you deal with any of us, you are directly dealing with the organization, the business. You are directly dealing with the business that you work with, the business that you are partners with, the business that you are colleagues with, the business that you have a partnership with. Remember, I said last time, I really don't like using the word distributors anymore because you're more than that. You know, we are a collection of friends who refuse to give up and carried on moving forward against all adversity to create the business that we have today. So when you deal with me, or the team, you're dealing with the business, not managers in between, not anything below the business, but the actual business, which puts you as partners in this organization closer to the organization than any other business, because no other business works in that way. Any of the other businesses that you are associated with, try and contact the owner, see if you get a response. Try and contact the teams that put the business together, that work at the business, to see if you get a response. No, it's always uplines or assistant managers or people like that, that aren't directly connected. So when you deal with me, or you deal with anybody here at HQ, you have a direct connection to the business. And that's what where we truly become that partnership, that we connect in the way that we do and we work in that partnership in this unique way that we can. And I've often said this to you before, you know, everything we do is unique and it's different. Um, because we've done that together. Some of the plans we have, some of the things we do, the fact that I regularly wear jumpers now and never owned any in my entire life, but it's so cold in the warehouse. You know, anything we do is different and it's unique and it's new and it's not reminiscent in the rest of the industry. And I don't mean to say that in um, any big headed kind of way. It's just the way that it is. You know, after years and years and years of being involved in the industry, one thing that we all learned was we all wanted an organization that not only that we could mold together, but one where we could have the things that we always felt were missing in the past. And one of those, of course, is service delivery. And you know, my goals on service delivery, I want to make it faster and faster. One day, we'll deliver an order to you before you've even placed it. I don't know how, but we'll find a way. So the first quarter, which is complete next week, gives us our first quarter of fulfillment from our new facility. Of course, we haven't always got it right. We haven't always got it the way we want to, but we're learning. Um, it's taken a year of planning to open our warehouse. Um, and our, if you remember, I showed you around it last time, and we'll do that again um, in the coming weeks uh, because there's been a lot of changes. And one of the greatest changes is, is a huge, huge amount of fulfillment stock that we constantly have which is much easier to control in such a large space. Um, and that brings me on to for forthcoming catalogs, of course. And it's when there's forthcoming catalogs, that stock fulfillment and stock um, storage just it becomes a, a massive increase. And that's what we've seen over the last few days. For example, um, products like these, excuse the noise, that we've just introduced, um, uh, in the last few days, already selling well and already going to be one of our clear uh, winners. 
Um, so it's been such a revolution for us to be able to do what we're doing, to execute the plans, improve service delivery, and give you all the things that we always wanted to do in the past in previous businesses, but just couldn't because there wasn't this direct connection. Now, many of the things we do are based on your ideas, your suggestions, your recommendations, whether it's products or service delivery, it's based on what you're telling us. And again, for me, as you are the business, that is so key that we are able to do that, that we are able to execute your plans and your ideas. You know, we've all been through such a strange year last year. And even during that strange year, between us all, we kept the business going. We kept the business upbeat. We kept it, you know, fulfilling as much as we possibly could, even in weeks and months where we couldn't get hold of products because there was a massive breakage in the supply chain. And there still is a big breakage in the supply chain. It could take years to correct after the pandemic year. Um, but we, because we worked together, worked stronger together, we kept it going. And, and to give you an idea of that, tomorrow, um, many of you will receive um, a growth email based on uh, business growth. Um, and year on year, the business, and I know we were in a difficult position last March as the country was going to lockdown, but we still had a 68% increase year on year in sales and fulfillment. And that's incredible. Um, yes, many companies will report increases because many companies were shut this time last year. But if you recall, we didn't shut, we carried on going, come what may, every day, every week, we carried on going. And that was, like I keep saying, born of our connection. That would not have been possible had we not got the connection that we have here with the people that work with us and the connection that we have with you, our partners in business. And that's what makes, like I keep saying, us so utterly unique. So I've already alluded to the catalog, the next new catalog coming out. Um, you'll get the full PDF by this time next week or thereabouts, but certainly next week. The week after, you'll actually have the live catalogue in your hands and orderable. Um, and I would like to say, you know, you've seen some of the products. I think we launched some of the products. Uh, the team launched some of the products earlier this week that we'd managed to um, source into the fulfillment area quicker than some others. Um, but I would say that the products are absolutely wonderful and I always say that about our products but I think you're going to be even more pleasantly surprised than usual it's not often that you can share the screen with a beautiful peacock well not every week anyway um, and I'd say you are going to be very pleased with the products they are all going to sell I think your customers are going to love them um, and it's going to be a fantastic catalog but that's not all uh, more details coming sooner or later, but there'll be another new catalogue in May. And this isn't about just pushing catalogues to you every other month. It's about variety. Now, I've always been a firm believer, having tried it before, having, having worked in the catalogue industry for over two decades now, and the first time I've owned jumpers, um, for over two decades now, I have an understanding, like many of you do, and like many of the team do, what kind of turnaround of catalogues actually works, which is one reason, you know, we don't um, create encyclopedic catalogues, because people psychologically just get bored of looking at catalogues with a thousand pages in them. So we're more likely to produce smaller catalogues, but far more often, and changing the availability, changing the uniqueness, and changing the look. So every other month or so, your customers see something completely brand new. And when they get used to that progress, they'll become used to being your customers and seeing these new products. So, Yes, next month, April, you get the garden, the outdoor and pets catalog. I keep forgetting what it's actually called. Um, 
and some of the products we've released from there are already starting to sell and your customers are already loving them but then we've got another little surprise for you in may and we'll also in the coming months we're doing more catalogs such as the serenity catalog um, which again has been a fantastic top end product for us again you know a different venture for us a great experiment and it actually worked and I think the figures do prove that and you'll see that in your email tomorrow how we've had a phenomenal increase but you know me I don't like talking about uh, phenomenal increases because at the end of the day what matters most is how business is performing right now how quickly your orders are being fulfilled how much products you have uh, actually got on your order that are in stock and as you remember I said to you last time the two things I really wanted to concentrate on this year now that we have our own fulfillment uh, facility is to keep our stock availability high never ever let it drop below 95% much higher if possible um, and then get service delivery as quick and as efficient to your doorstep as we possibly can I think the days of waiting a week for a, an order are long gone, unless it's been lost or delayed for some reason. But the days of waiting for an order to arrive if we're in a week or even over a few days are long, long gone. Today, it's about service delivery. It's why companies like Amazon are so successful. You can order something today and have it tomorrow. And, and that's the kind of standard that I want to go for ultimately, that people get their deliveries as quick as that because then you'll retain customers. You'll have customers who can get products from you only marginally slower than Amazon can deliver them. Now, we'll never compete with businesses like that, but what we will do is constantly, constantly try and improve Somebody's making a noise over there. I think it's Kirsty as usual. But we'll constantly improve our service delivery and product availability. Anyway, moving on. So catalogs coming and we'll talk about the showcase in a minute. But first, we have a whole load of competitions to get through. Competition winners are six routes to win dining cards, uh, 50 pound dining cards, six different routes to win them. So we'll, let's start going through those. That Route one was the highest personal retail and each one of these three people who are the top three will get a 50 pound dining card of course that was in preparation for restaurants and eating spaces all opening again yes debbie i can see that you want tortoise products i can see what you're saying there and i'm sure there'll be something tortoise based sooner or later <laughs> Um, okay, Route 1, highest personal retail. In position 3, the wonderful Stephen Payton. Congratulations to you. In position 2, Ali Lloyd and Jeff Locke. Congratulations to you. And in position 1, with a staggering personal retail value of £8,387.22 in four weeks, they come in at number 1. Congratulations to you. All three of you get a 50 pound dining card congratulations and thank you for all the efforts uh, you have put into the business and certainly leading the way where personal retail is concerned which of course as i've always said is key to the business retail is king you have to sell products to make a business work which is why we open our own warehouse facility route number two the top sponsors with the highest new business sales so in other words not just about bringing people in but those people then going on to do sales in position three Congratulations again, Ali Lloyd and Jeff Locke. Congratulations to you. In position number two, Yvonne Meisel. Thank you again, as always, bringing in people who go on to do sales. In position number one, absolutely delighted with three brand new distributors that have a combined sale of £311.55, which is phenomenal new start for new people. Becky Millard, congratulations to you. Fantastic to see you at the top of our, one of our competition tables. And all three of you will be getting dining cards. Now we had route three, the most direct 
dispatch sales. So um, products that you are through us directly dispatching to your customers. In position number three, Cynthia Millard, congratulations to you. In position two, Chris Ritchie, again, congratulations to you, fantastic. And in position number one, the one and only Stephen Payton with a staggering 183 individual direct dispatches. That's 183 single customer serviced by one person through direct dispatch in just one period. Congratulations to you, absolutely fantastic growth. Then we have Route 4 and the Facebook, 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 Facebook Interaction HQ Award. And what that was, we had a Viva MK Happiness Week because I think we were all tired of the times we were going through and we just chose or choose to be happy. So it was about talking about the business publicly on social media and hashtagging it Viva MK Happiness. I have three winners that were chosen by the HQ team and later on when we communicate with you about all the winners, you'll see their winning entries where they use the hashtag Viva MK Happiness hashtag. So um, in no particular order, the three winners are Marie Dalton, congratulations to you, Samantha Lane, Congratulations to you, Samantha. And in and third, it's not third position, but the third one, in no particular order, Lisa and Kevin Wright, Mr. and Mrs. Enthusiastic. Congratulations to all three of you. Your um, hashtag Viva MK Happiness not only got huge interaction, we were absolutely fantastic, but it's not as simple as that. Congratulations to you three. However, because the entries were all so brilliant, and they really were, it's so brilliant, to see that hashtag, to see people talking about happiness, associating it with the business, and you know, generally choosing to be happy. I'm also going to do a prize draw and pick out a further four winners. So in here, we have got all the Viva MK hashtag, uh, Viva MK happiness hashtag um, qualifiers or people who who used. Um, the hashtag. So I'm going to pick out another four winners. Uh, these three that I've already mentioned were the ones chosen by the team, but because the winners were so brilliant and the entries were so brilliant, we just could not let that pass. So the first one is Colleen Wright. Congratulations to you. Um, congratulations, Colleen. Um, and we will put out which winning posts they were, of course. Um, in uh, number two, Marie Komjatiova. Congratulations to you. Number three, uh, Andrea Lane, congratulations to you. And the fourth one, give this a good rustle around, is this one. Louise Reddick, congratulations to you. Uh, all the hashtags, you know, I would like to award all these people, but uh, I would really run out of vouchers and money if I did that. But congratulations to all seven people who, whose hashtag Viva MK Happiness really stood out. Um, but all of these stood out, which is why I did the extra draw. All of you get £50 dining vouchers. Um, then we have route five, which is the positive growth. So anybody who had positive growth went into this um, planter, which has got all the names in it. Again, loads of, loads of names in here, uh, absolutely loads of them. All these people with positive growth. So I'll pick out, I will stop making that noise, but I do enjoy it. Um, I'll pick out four winners from here who all um, had positive growth. So first one is the lovely Peter Draper. That's the first one. 50 pound dining voucher for you. Uh, second one is Susan Perry and Raymond Walls. Congratulations to you. Third one, and I'll have a good rummage around in this dog planter. Um, third one is Julian West. Congratulations to you. And the fourth one in the positive growth dog planter prize draw is Pamela Lochlin. 
congratulations to you. You'll all get 50 pound dining vouchers. Um, we'll put that one aside. <laughs> and get the next one, which is this one. Another dog planter. They're great, absolutely fantastic product. I think your customers are going to love these. Um, and this one is for um, all the people that achieved um, star and above in the sales plan in the last period and again there'll be four winners it's just while well, the team have written all these out you see look so i don't get it wrong it's all written out here <laughs> thank you team so we'll pick out four winners after this and we'll see who they are all of these people achieved sales plan success so we have irene jones congratulations to you number two we have Paul Clark, congratulations to you. A good rummage around. And we have Philip Ryder, congratulations to you. And another rummage around. We have, um, oh, come on. We have Anna Mack, congratulations to you as well. All the winners, thank you to all of you for taking part in all the competitions but not just the taking part the fact that you are all engaged in the business you know and again this competition was a recommendation and suggestion from people in our business you know so many things that we do are done from your recommendations and again like i said at the beginning it makes our business so unique to be able to do that. You know, I guarantee that you can't just contact any old business and give a recommendation and it's followed through. But here we can do that because that's what this was all about. It was about the people's business. It was about friendship. It was about connection. It was about partnership. And I never, ever, ever want to back down from that because that is such a massive, unique selling point for our business. And in the entire industry, no one can do it like we do. So... I just want to briefly talk about the forthcoming showcase. Um, I know um, we're all looking forward to times changing and going back to some kind of normality. I do believe that will be one huge shenanigan fueled party. There's no doubt about that. You know, we always have lots of announcements, lots of brilliant speakers and we'll have all that. But my main motive is just to get you all together. Get you all together and enjoy the good old times and have fun and have the most malarkey that we can fit into one single night. And that's the intention. Over and above any training, over and above any um, uh, uh, announcements or anything else. So, as you know, the, we launched the location of that a few weeks ago. I will give you a discount code to book hotels. I'm waiting for the hotel complexes to get their acts together because as you know, most of them are still closed. And so we're dealing with people that are all working from home and they certainly don't get their act together like we guys do. Um, however, many of you have been booking through booking portals and you're getting some great deals. And I'd say the greatest deals you can get nowadays are the ones that allow you to cancel for no fee because as much as we're all being optimistic about what's going to happen um, as the year goes on, we all want it to change, we all want to connect, we all want to get together, one never knows what's going to happen. So booking portals are offering great deals, bookings.com, hotel.com and places like that at um, our location, which as you know, is the Jury's Conferencing Hotel um, at Hinkley Island in Hinkley. Huge complex. I did actually get a chance to go and visit it. I've done comp um, conferences there before and um, attended conferences. It is perfect for us. And for once free parking and out the hustle and bustle of Birmingham, you know, it's very easy to get to. I think it's going to be an absolutely amazing event. So 
Remember next week, of course, uh, it's Easter, which means there's a delivery schedule. We will pick and pack to the last possible moment. But remember, we have to rely on delivery agents. Otherwise, we'd be packing all through Easter if we could, if uh, DPD and uh, Hermes were available to pick up our orders. Um, so bear in mind that the last orders leaving here will be Thursday, and then we won't be um, dispatching anything else until Tuesday. But that doesn't mean we're not open for business. All the shops and all the cafes catalogs are still working and going to work very well. And like I said, this time next week, you'll have the full PDF of, um, what's it called? Outdoor and Pets to show um, every all your customers. And trust me, if these products are anything to go by, you are going to love what's in that catalog. And not only that, what you'll see in the forthcoming catalog in May. So next two to three months, if the plan goes to plan, and you know, I never say things if I'm not pretty sure that we will follow them through. There's no point building expectations. You know, under promise, over deliver. That's the, that, that's the new standard for today. Always under promise and always over deliver. If I get my way in the next few months, you'll have a new catalog almost every single month. Because we can, because we should, and because it actually works. And that's the ethos of this business. If it works, work together, work as friends, keep this connection going. And remember, we are so unique in the marketplace and it makes a difference. Thank you for listening. Thank you to all the winners. There'll be full communication out uh, later this afternoon talking about all the winners and their achievements. Um, look out for the email tomorrow about growth and personal growth in the business and your personal achievements. It's going to be an incredible season. And of course, I don't know why I'm doing a public service announcement, but don't forget to put your clocks forward either this weekend. Have a great weekend and thank you for everything you do. Partners in Viva MK. Thank you.